Hello you guys, Greg Eunice Marie here. Welcome to my channel. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button and thumbs up this video. I promise you it won't hurt. So I know you guys are probably tired of seeing me by now in this dang bonnet thing because I'm I'm tired of seeing myself in it too. I'm like, yo girl, do your hair, okay? But I am on a roll today with filming videos for you guys and getting them out there. So regardless of if I got the same stuff on, okay, we're gonna get it done. I just did an exfoliating mask using the um Thomas something mask, I forgot the name of it already, um, on my face and it was really, really amazing. If you guys have not seen that review, I will leave a link down below, above, go check it out. It's a really great um, exfoliating face mask or exfoliating treatment that I got from the Sephora Play Box, so great find. So now we're going to be reviewing this Belief, Believe in Truth Moisturizing Eye Balm. Um, I also received this in the Sephora Play Box for February. And usually I don't play around with too many eye creams and eye balms, but why not? You know, hey, give it a try. It's not going to hurt. So let's get into what this is. This is an actual sample size. And it's by Belief Moisturizing Eye Balm. Provides intense moisture up to 26 hours. Mm. Mm -hmm. This eye cream has been clinically tested to provide up to 26 hours of moisture and improve skin elasticity. Um, I don't know if I would ever really test this out for 26 hours because first of all I wash my face so I will wash my face at night so this would not be on my face oh really wouldn't test that out but how to use this is that you would gently put a small amount and massage under the eye rim area with ring finger until well absorbed avoid direct contact with the eye that's pretty obvious this is what it looks like it smells like the typical old lady cream. <laughs> I'm not lying though. It smells like the typical old lady eye cream. Like I'm just being, I'm just being completely honest if I must. All right, so you're gonna take a little bit on your finger, like so, and place it under the eye, and massage it in until it's well absorbed. I'm almost gonna be 30, you guys. Maybe I should start using, um, you know eye creams more often and lately I've been noticing I've been looking a little tired under the eyes I used to never have that issue but I don't know maybe it's just me getting older I have no idea you know when you're about to hit 30 everything starts to come into play put a little bit more on this side it's very moisturizing though actually it's not drying but very moisturizing and it makes the skin feel really good underneath the eye kind of refreshing too this is really nice actually. I actually really do like this eye cream. Mm. Initially, besides the old, the old lady smell, it's very moisturizing for the under eye area. And um, yeah, I mean I really do like it. It's actually pretty nice. And like I said, I don't dabble with a lot of eye creams. When I do get one as a sample or something, I do give it a try. You know, I'm open to trying out eye creams and I think because I'm getting a little older, eye creams may start becoming a little bit more of my friend okay because y'all see I got these little lines right here that I never really used to have before but now all of a sudden they're becoming more prominent to me but I would definitely leave information for this down below I think that it's just a nice little cool little sample for you to try out um and of course it was a part of Sephora play box and yeah it's really moisturizing I can't tell you if it's going to last up 26 hours. I'm not keeping this on my face. I've washed my face twice a day, so that's not going to happen. But all in all, I do feel like it's a good moisturizing um, eye cream initially. Now, to really see the benefits of it, I think you would have to use, of course, the eye cream for some continuous time to really see a difference in your under eye area. You know, you can't use eye cream for like one day and be like, oh my gosh, my life has changed. No, eye cream is one of those products just along with like conditioners or treatments that you have to use consistently in order for you to see a difference in the under eye area. But initially, I actually like it. It's nice and lightweight. It's um, moisturizing and I like that. I don't want anything too greasy, heavy underneath the eye area and this is just perfectly fine. So if you guys have used this before, go ahead and comment down below, let me know. And um, yeah, let's talk about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is your girl Eunice Marie. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you in a later video.